Hello everybody, this is Dr. Kevin Pallas. Oh, hang on a second, here's my snow globe. Now we're ready. Today we're going to talk about there's more to being a chiropractor than just a great adjuster. I'll tell you a little bit of a story. We just put on a seminar in Atlanta. As you might guess, there's a certain chiropractic school, the world's largest chiropractic school, Life University. And we had a lot of students come there. And the amazing part, these kids are technical, academic, smart, bright, incredible. They're great adjusters, but they had some missing ingredients. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about those. A lot of the younger students, because they're in that bubble at school, don't think these things matter. Boy, when they found out, when we started role playing between the doctor and the patient, it really came alive. The first thing we want to talk about is creating relationships because how you make your patients feel has a lot to do whether they're gonna stay, whether they're gonna pay, whether they're gonna refer. Believe it or not, some of us, no one watching this, just, just me here, sometimes we come off as too academic, researchy, prim and proper, technical. So relationships are so important between the doctor and patient. The second thing is communication skills. Some people are just too analytical, technical. It's almost like that fella on, uh, what's that show? The Big Bang Theory, Sheldon. That's how some people come off. You gotta sit there with a keyboard and Google what the guy's saying because he's so smart. And you guys are smart, but it puts a little bit of distance between you. So communication skills, ooh, you need to work on those a little bit. Third thing is patient education. Most people just think it's how they feel. They wanna come in for a few visits, but they they're never going to know about kids. They're never going to know about wellness. They won't know the big dimension to chiropractic, just the smaller one. And the fourth one, and this was really tough for the kids, and all of us, it's just not them, it's all of us. Boundaries. The ability to ask for money and commitment. And if we don't do that, a lot of us will say, we'll worry about the money. Let's just get you better first. That's a that's a con job. You're not telling the truth on that one. You gotta be upfront with people and you gotta be okay with having those boundaries and knowing they gotta be able to pay. They gotta be able to stay on track. And you gotta tell people their recommendations. Don't cave when you give recommendations. Don't cave when you're asking for money. So again, there's a little bit more than just being a great adjuster. That's important, please don't throw away those skills, but there's more of being a great chiropractor. It's about making people feel good or the relationship you create. It's communication skills. It's patient education. They've got to know what chiropractic is. And there's boundaries. There's recommendations and money. you got to be okay with them. This is Dr. Kevin from the New Renaissance saying we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.